going to do finally my first um, installment slash episode of my Avengers tutorials series. Um, I've been planning this for months, I've been announcing this for weeks, and um, finally it's here, the first one. And first up is, I hope this is clear, this is Iron Man. Um, he is actually one of my favorites, besides Thor, because Thor is just my, I just... I love Tony Stark and I love his suit, so today I am going to do my interpretation on his colors and style and everything. And without any further ado, if you want to know how I got this look, then please keep on watching. So the first thing you want to do is apply a base to your eyelids to prevent the eyeshadow from creasing, and the one I'm using is my MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot. I'm now going to take this MAC Beth Mask Shade and Smoke Eyeshadow Liner thing, and I'm going to take the dark side, and with this I'm going to start defining my crease by cutting it with an eyeliner. Holy crap, what was that? Ugh. Scary room is scary. Now you're going to blend that out with your brush of choice. And just blend it out and make it softer. Now I'm going to take MAC's Sweet Chestnut Eyeshadow. And from the Makeup Studio 18 color eyeshadow palette, I'm going to make a mixture between these two bottom red colors. And that little mixture is going over that bath mask liner. Now leaving Sweet Chestnut out of the mix, I'm gonna go and blend this all up. And I'm gonna go up pretty far and pretty high because this is not a natural look at all. This is more for like a show. For my highlight, I will be using my Inglot palette and I'm gonna use these two colors. Now, I don't know the names or the numbers because I couldn't put it anywhere, so I will put that on my blog. The main highlighting color is gonna be this one and then just to make it a little bit more gold and yellow, I'm gonna use that one. And then just start blending the red a little bit more and make it a little bit more extreme. For my eyelid, I'm using that yellow Inglot color again. And I'm taking a bit of the yellow from the Makeup Studio 18 color eyeshadow palette. This is going all over the lid. For my bottom lash and I'm going to use this red from Inglot. Again, the number will be on my blog. And I'm mixing it with a little bit of Sweet Chestnut again. I also blend it right here on that outer third with the yellow, or the gold, or however you want to see it. Using the same colors, I'm going to make a line towards my inner corners and leave the first spot open. Now I'm going to take Face Front's Acrylic Apple Torch Artistic Pigment, and that is going on top on my lower lash line, or my lower lid, or whatever. Tony Stark wouldn't mind if I set lower lid or lash line. For my inner corners, I'm using my OCC Obscure Pigment. And on top of that, my Jewel Effects in Shine by Makeup Studio. Then all that is left is to line your lashes softly with a mixture of a black eyeshadow and sweet chestnut or whatever sort of dark burgundy color you have. That's my brother with his best friend acting like a fool. Or is it Tony Stark? Who knows? Then I'm gonna run a little bit more of that Inglot gold color along the highest points of my cheekbone. This just kinda, for me, completes the look. But of course you have to blend it out. You don't want it to be like Stupid. Now I'm just going to curl my lashes and apply some mascara and the mascara I will be using is my Makeup Studio One Proof 3D Extra Black for the chrome or the steel that um, Iron Man has as well. I'm actually going to use a sheet of nail rock and these are like the minx like stickers for your nails and this is in metallic red and I thought this would be perfect to kind of resemble the chrome or the steel of his suit. So I'm gonna cut a little curve out of one of the nails and then just stick it right there under my eyes at the corners for a nice sort of finishing touch. 
Okay, so before we do the lips, let's hop to the cheeks first. Um, I contoured with my NYX blush in... I cannot. NYX blush in taupe. Then to warm up my face and give me a little bit more of a healthy glow, I used my Disobey blush by Illamasqua. As a blush, and I used this really, really lightly, I used the MAC Trace Gold blush and this is a really nice bronzy shine and I use that really lightly because this all is really shiny as well and then for the gold highlighter I already told you this but that is from my Inglot palette that I custom made and I use these two colors with the emphasis on that one right there for my lips I'm gonna use MAC lipstick in pure Zen and then I'm gonna go back into my Inglot palette and I'm gonna make a mixture between those two again and I am going to highlight my lips with that. And that guys completes my first Avengers tutorial. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. For a full list of every single product used, go to my website, NikkiTutorials.com. I am on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, and that all is Nikki Tutorials. I want to thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully I will see you guys next time. Bye guys!